All right, Isaac, so you are a leading goal scorer here of the team, one of the top goal scorers of the Eastern League. Talk to us about, you know, the journey from the beginning of the season to where we're at now, and how is it to be a, a senior in the team and, and being the top goal scorer here? Uh, it's been a long run, especially with my team. Uh, we've been through ups and downs, especially this year, starting with the brand new team since we lost a lot of seniors last year. And I feel like it's been a really big step for us because us seniors, we're new, we're, we're new to this um, role of being the bigger brother to these young players that have joined the team. And I feel like it's a really big step for us. And I feel like it's been going great so far. We've been learning, we've been getting chemistry with each other and just as playing as a team makes me really happy because it shows that no matter how, no matter what the circumstances may be, you could still pull through with your team. At the end of the season, a couple of games left here, uh, battling for, for top position in the Eastern League. Uh, how do you uh, close, close up the season and what's the mindset heading up to these final games? I feel like closing up the season is going to come starting off with the starting tempo of the game, always putting everything, your all into the play, finishing every playoff. Um, you know, building the play with your teammates, lift, uplifting your teammates. You know, it all starts from just communication and it all starts with positivity, you know. So I feel like um, just us uplifting each other and playing with, with all we have, it's going to be a really good, really good thing for us, especially with the talent that we have on the team. So I feel like it's gonna, we have a really good, really good team. So I feel like for these upcoming games, we're just going to put everything on the line. We're going to do everything we can. And we're going to try to get the wins. All right, Isaac, lastly here, uh, big game coming up uh, Friday, uh, probably game of the season so far for you all. You're battling Roosevelt, uh, other top dog of the Eastern League. Uh, how is the team preparing for this specific game, and how are you approaching this game in specific? Uh, I feel like we're preparing for this game mentally and physically. We, both, we, we know that the game before that we played against them was a really rough game. It was a horrible game in the rain, their home, and... There's not much we could say. It was both. It was to both of our advantages, both their disadvantages, playing in the rain and the mud. But I feel like they played a really good game, and we we played them. We know how they play. We they know how we play, and I feel like it all just comes down to the way we want, who wants it more, who wants to who wants to win more. And I feel like it's gonna be a really good game, especially since it's to for the number one spot in the league. So I feel like it's gonna be a really really intense game. Awesome, Isaac. Thank you so much for your time. Thank and best you. of luck on Friday. All right, I'm here with Alan Gonzalez. He's one of our senior captains of uh, the Southeast High School soccer team here. Alan, uh, you know, it's great chatting with you here. Thank you so much for your time. I uh, just want to talk to you about, you know, the, the you're, you're a senior here mm -hmm. for Southeast as a captain. You're a defending champion. Yes, sir. Talk to me how, how it feels for you personally being this year, last year, and being a defending champion. How have you uh, jumped into the season? Um, I jumped into the season thinking, you know, okay, we're defending champions. I gotta, I gotta try to do my best to try to try to keep Southeast on top, like how I, how I always been. Like we have a, like last year, last year was a, a team that I can't never forget. We were we were unstoppable, but then I had to come back to reality, knowing next year, well, my now year, my senior year, I would have to lose a lot of seniors. Then I, I would have to come to the test that the team I would have to play against now is all young, but now. But now we're all. But we we been we were we've been through a lot. We, we went through a lot of struggles, and everything. And we, and we were like, okay, no matter no matter what age we are, we're gonna get it done. Uh, talk to me about the difference between uh, last year to this year, uh, where in terms of where you're at now, and what challenges you've seen throughout the season. So what? So one thing, one of the challenges that we, we that we have had this season from last year is that many of our players were new for this year's team. And the thing is that we have not, we didn't start off as a, as a unit like that, how we had the last year's team. This year, we, have, we, we started, we had to get to know each other, play each other more, get the chemistry up. Because last year, last year we had, we had played for at least like a good three years all together. So which is why we were so good at each other, because we all bonded. But another challenge we also lacked on is that um, we, we needed someone to have more leadership for the team. So someone that could show everybody with that that what we could do, no matter no matter how old or how, how young the team is. All right. Lastly, Adan, big game coming up on Friday, uh, Friday game of the week for sure in the Eastern League, Southeast versus Roosevelt uh, High School. Tough game last last time you guys were down there, a four nothing defeat. Complete opposite, I feel in terms of weather wise. That last game I was there, there tough tough game, a lot of rain, difficult field. Uh, how are you guys preparing for the game on Friday and how are you looking forward to the game at all? 
uh, like I told the guys that uh, all we had in our mind is win, win, and win. That that no matter what happened with that score, is it was a score. The anything could happen at this point. But like I told them that we're we're playing at home. We're, we we, we got to show them that 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 four nothing that four nothing defeat was nothing to us, and that we're ready for them. Because the last time we played them, we were we weren't ready. But but now we're ready for them, and we're gonna bring we're gonna bring you to home again, another league championship.